It was the year 1998 when the legend was born. That was when the bike Transalp left its first tire marks in the mountains. Now, 25 years later, this epic mountain bike race across the Alps is still as exciting, challenging and fascinating as it has always been. In 2023, we celebrate its anniversary with a route that is both fresh and crazy, showcasing everything the Alps have to offer. Along this trek, you will pass the most extraordinary places in Transalp history and seek adventure on wild trails that have never been explored before. From Naudas to Lake Reschen, this is a journey through the land of the Enduro Trails. So be prepared for a bumpy ride over roots and stones. On that first stage, with one of the highest single trail factors of the entire week. But this trail paradise has more to offer. Right after the start, you also get one of the best panoramas of the whole week. With the huge Ortler, whose mighty glacier peak towers high above Lake Reschen. There's a lot of enchanting scenery to see on these 52 kilometers with 2,200 meters of vertical climb. Day 2 offers a tremendous variety of landscapes for the eyes. From the green of the apple orchards in Vinchko Valley, up to the grey gravel slopes of the Stilfser Joch National Park. But this is not just a sightseeing tour, it also offers some cool biking experience. Dig your way through the old smuggler's trail to Livigno. And when they put a permanent grin on your face, you don't even notice that, at the end, you have almost a hundred kilometers and over 3,000 meters of climbing on your watch. Beauty and the Beast, Heaven and Hell, call it what you want. You never know what's around the corner. Muscle blasting ramps or heartbreaking trails. You have to work your way through these 65 kilometers and 2200 meters of climbing but you will be rewarded with the highest trail portion of all stages. But not only the percentage of trails, also their quality is at a maximum. This is the Queen stage. You can't get more experience in one day. Paso Gavia, a cycling classic, and the magical Alta Via Camuna, a Transalp classic, add up to a superlative day trip. Climb up to the highest point of the Transalp and reach for the sky on epic lines far above the tree lines, collecting almost 3,300 meters of altitude on this never-ending 100-kilometer trek into Val di Sole. Brenza plays the leading role in this monumental nature film. From Madonna di Campiglio to Malga Movlina, one of the most famous and beautiful trans-up routes of all time awaits you. 
you get so close to the huge walls of this mountain, massive. But there's also a hidden highlight. A wild descent in the forest with earthy tracks and enchanted trails. That's why stage 5 also has a lot to offer. On these 70 kilometers to Roncone, with 2,500 vertical meters to be ticked off. From the secret hideaway to the red carpet, the trails between Valle di Cise and Valle di Ledro are still a connoisseur's choice. But at Paso de Malzo, the curtain opens for one of the world stars among the mountain bike spots. This is a highly concentrated package. 64 kilometers and 2,500 meters of climbing, full of wow moments, peaking in a stunning panorama view over the Lake Garda Mountains. Short and crisp. This is the last stage on the way to the anniversary party. But there's still some work to do. And the typical Stony Lago trails demand your concentration until the very end. Boca di Trat, that's the last pass on the way to Lake Garda. But there's still a lap of honor on the course of the Garda Trentino Bike Marathon, with one last climb on top. But after 47 kilometers, and 1,700 meters of vertical, the champagne corks can finally pop. Sign up now for Max's Bike Trends Up 2023.